happy Saturday team. Welcome everybody. Hello, Charlotte and Lori. Hi, everybody. Let me know if you are here and let me know if you can see me and if you can hear me uh, because I'm flying solo today. That's why my kids aren't here. So I'm doing everything myself. I'm doing the production. I'm going to lead you in a workout. I'm going to hopefully get the, um, the timer started. We may not have music today and that's okay. You can put on your own music if you want to go ahead and get that set up. Hey, Dixie is here. Hey, Alyssa. Ava is getting the workout right before dinner. Tammy is here. Elosia. Can you hear me? Let me know. Somebody tell me. Hey, Charlotte. Um, welcome everybody. I'm guessing you would tell me if you couldn't hear me. So, hey, Laura, Alyssa, no kids today. No kids today. Yep. Uh, yeah, a little bit of a crazy day, but I'm here and we're going to get it done. Hi, Elaine is here. Mariah, hoping to get through it without the baby waking up. Yay, thank you, Charlotte. <laughs> so you can see me and you can hear me. Diane, Kat, hello, hello. Olivia just joined the BAC. Welcome, Olivia. I'm so happy that you are in the athletic club. Mel is here. Carrie, Angela, yay. <laughs> Thank you for believing in me when I have to wear all the hats, the producer hat, sound, camera, all of it. I gotta make sure um, that I can see myself over here. All right, so we are gonna get it done. Happy Saturday. Mel, Kirsty is here. Tamika. Lori is here. Amy in Virginia. Ah, I'm Amy from Virginia. <laughs> Naomi is here. All right, team. So today we are doing a 35 minute body weight power sculpt, right? So if you were here last week or the week before, we had kettlebell, we had dumbbell power sculpt. Similar format, a little different. We may not have as many compound moves because we're just body weight today, but same idea that we are going to get it done where we start back to basics. We maybe do another back to basics. We put them together with one doing power, one doing sculpt, which often will be a pulse. And then uh, going on from there, Shannon is here. Yay, able to join. Caitlin made it. <laughs> Listen, maybe I could have Bingo do my assistant. Yeah, that's our new puppy. Uh, that would be a disaster. Um, <laughs> anyway, all right. I am so glad everybody is here. Oh, Faye, what would Saturdays be without the workout? Megan is here. Oh, her husband took the kids out. Amazing. Yay. Yes. Tammy and Shannon Jersey in the house. BAC Body Fit Athletic Club in the house. All right. So let's get it done. You don't need any equipment, just some space to move. Make sure you have your water. Make sure you are ready to go. Of course, I'm going to give you lots of options. Let's get it done. Let's see if I can start my timer from here. I've got my mouse. Let's see. Ah, I did it. All right. <laughs> all right, team. So go ahead. Give yourself some space. If you're just joining, I'm wearing all the hats today and I am doing production as well on this. As you know, usually Kurt gets me all set up. That's why the kids are in here like crazy. And then they run in. I'm sorry if you missed my children today. I do too, but certainly it was a lot quieter, right? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna get it done. Body weight, power, sculpt. Let's get one big deep breath in, whoo, and out. Uh, Mallory is asking, does power, power sculpt mean power pulse again? Yes, I said it the last two weeks. So I said, uh, I should have called it power pulse because a lot of the sculpt is going to be a pulse, but I was worried that might scare some people off. So not you, you all love the pulse, right? You would love the challenge. Let's take it out right here. Oh, thank you, Charlotte. Hope you're feeling better and you can join us next week. Charlotte has been fighting some illness, but you'll get back at it. I'm glad that you are resting and letting your body heal. You will be back. All right. Natalia is here. Emily just saying hi, doing yard work. Might do this later, I hope so. Whew. All right, team, let's take it right here. <sighs> Up and down. Oh, thanks, Carrie. This is one of our, this is our new body fit logo, like this one. Let's take it flat back down and round it up. This shirt, this tank, I think they actually are out of stock on the website because of the type of tank it is but we're gonna have lots of new tanks and tees on the website with our new logo. 
Roll those shoulders here. I'm here, is here. Hello, hello. So be on the lookout for those. Here to here. Walk them in and round it up. Whew. All right, let's take it just a little side to side in those hips right here. Hold it here, big stretch. Back through the center. Hold it here, big stretch. Back through the center, one more each side. And up. Good, let's take it to a little squat and a hip roll, if that's good for you. You don't have to get super low, remember we're still just warming up all the way through. And then let's hinge it right here. Hey, Sammy is here with Mallory. Hi, Sammy. I love when your kiddos say hi to me and I can say back. Make sure you cheer on your mama as she works hard. Let's reach it down and reach it up. Ashley can't do the live today. Toddler having a meltdown. I can relate when he's asleep. She's gonna do it later. All right, guys, take it here. Walk it out into the inchworm if that's good for you. If you need to take it to knees, that works too, or stay up top. Walk it back all the way up. Take this at your own pace. The goal is to get that warm up through the spine, through the back, and get that core fired up and ready to go. Yes, Mary Ellen is here. Rocking some 70s classic music, I love it. Let's hold this one here. So let's take a little forward and back, into the toes, into the shoulders. And then take it to that down dog, back to center. If you need to, you can stay on the knees and just take it child's pose to center. But if you're able, we just want that little back stretch. And here, walk it back right through here. Round it up, tap it back. Open up those hips, here to here. Let's take it right here. You can keep it just right here if that's good for you to get that hip opener. Otherwise, if you're able to take it low, walk that foot out just a bit if that's comfortable for you so you get that nice good stretch. Arm up, drop your back knee, down and up. And then take that top hand, you can be down on the knee or up, reach under and up. Good, step it up, switch it here again. You can just hold it here, get that nice good hip opener. You can even walk that foot out. If you can take it down, take it down. Walk the foot out even more, reach up, drop the knee. And then take that top arm, reach under and up, under and up. Walk it in and round it up. All right, team, catch your breath. Let's tap and reach across. All right, so if you are just joining Brittany first live, welcome. All right, so if this is your first live, we're gonna do right now about a 30 minute workout now that we're warmed up. And afterwards, after we cool down, we are going to have a quick Q and A if you have any questions for me, or if you wanna say hi, or for me to say hi to your kiddos bring them in, but we'll just take a few minutes and we'll talk a little bit about what is coming up this week and next month. We got some fun stuff coming in the athletic club and also just here at Body Fit by Amy, our next challenge. So we're gonna talk about that and then if you have any questions, feel free to save them to the end. Let's see. Jennifer says, love the videos. How positive. Oh, yay. Trying to keep everybody motivated. Different modification. Yes. Listen, everybody is on their own journey. So remember that today. I want you to be where you are today. That's going to be different for everybody. You're all on your own journey. It's going to be different day to day for all of us, right? So you do you. Challenge yourself, but in a way that's work, that works for you. That's why I'm gonna give you lots of options. All right, so we're starting back to basics. You can just keep it here. If you wanna take it a little hop step for a little more cardio, you can. Back to basics, 40 seconds. Then we have another back to basics for 40 seconds. Then we put them together, but not your traditional put them together. We put them together in our power sculpt round, which often will have two rounds. We're one pulse, one power. One power, one pulse. All right, don't worry, it's gonna make sense once we get there. We're gonna start with just your basic lunge. So core is engaged, not holding your breath, but strong foundation. 
shoulders back. We're gonna take it to a reverse lunge. So you're dropping it back. If that feels weird to you at all, you can tap it here or you can keep it stationary. But join me here, train track stance in three, two, one. Here we go, drop it down and bring it up. Core is engaged, chest is lifted. Remember on this lunge, you can lean forward a tad as long as we're not rounding in the back. You can have that knee go forward. We're not too worried about that. We just want that weight in the front heel. Both legs are working. Nice wide stance. Again, a mistake sometimes people make is we're too close. Let's keep it wide. Yes. 10 seconds to go. Breathing through here. <sighs> Driving up through the heel. Everything's pulled in. Yay, Fozzie is here. Three, two, one. Relax. All right, this one's not so bad. Upper body. I want you to really think about it. We're going to do a pull down. A fly in, pull down, squeeze in your back, and then squeeze in the fly. So mostly we're thinking about the pull down, core is engaged, you can stagger your feet. Here we go. Pull, squeeze, pull. Looks simple, but I want you to really think about that squeeze. Once we get 40 seconds in, you're gonna feel it even more. Pull the shoulder blades in, pull the elbows down, squeeze it in. Yes. Once we get going on the pulses with this and we have two more rounds, then you're really gonna feel those back and shoulders, right? For now, keeping it simple, mobility, squeeze, breathe. We got five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. All right, so power, sculpt, round. Here is what it looks like. We are gonna take it here. We've got power with the lunge. We're gonna do a lunge jump or a lunge pulse if that's better for you. And then pulse it here, three, two, one. Join me right here in three, two, one. Power lunge, pulse three, two, one. Take it up, three, two, one. Up, so I'm keeping my hands here. Three, two, one, squeeze, whoo. Three, two, one. Remember your power can also just be a pulse or power up on the toes, squeeze in your back, take it up, three, two, one, power, pulse, I know, up, pulse, 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 last one, burn, right, little heart rate, all right, now we're gonna switch it, we got power in our back muscles, and our upper body pulse in our legs. So you guessed it, watch me here. We're gonna power, knee comes in, pulse three, two, one. Knee comes in, pulse it down. Let's do it, 40 seconds, three, two, one. Let's power knee, three, two, one. Power, three, two, one. Of course, if you want, you can jump it and then pulse in the lunge. Jump it or power up. Three, two, one, power, squeeze. Three, two, one, burn with both. If you can, keep those arms up. I know it's tempting to wanna to bring them down, but let's keep that back working. Yes, you can. Five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. Did we feel it? I think so. Quick sip of water if you need it. There's that heart rate. All right, so why, this, why we love this format is because we get it all, right? We get that good burn, we get our power, we get our back to basics. Remember, you can always stay with back to basics if that is what's best for you. Hey, Bonnie, happy Saturday. All right, team, we're gonna do the other side. We're gonna mix it up a little bit with our upper body, all right? But we are gonna go to that lunge on the other side. So shake it out. Give yourself just a few more seconds to let that heart rate come down just enough, and then we get back into that lunge. So we're starting with that other side lunge. Core is engaged. <laughs> Mallory says, we felt it. <laughs> All right, so let's get it done. 40 seconds in three, two, reverse lunge. Here we go. So drop it down, press it up right here. <sighs> Remember modification, you can just tap it back. You don't have to get as low. 
or you can keep it stationary if that's better for you with balance here to here we've got that strong foundation in the core and pelvic floor that means we're not holding our breath or sucking in we're just keeping it here down and up yes and breathe there we go good keep it going five seconds to go everything's pulled in we got three two one all right watch me with the upper body so again gonna feel simple on this first round but then when we add more rounds to it you're gonna feel it even more so we got our biceps we got our triceps we're curl we're kick back curl kick back join me right here here we go bicep curl kick it back we're high and high so on the curl i want you to really squeeze towards the shoulders and then push to the sky with the triceps biceps triceps and with that of course you're getting that full rotation in the elbows which is really good for elbow joints for elbow mobility right so keep them up up and push up and push yes you can and breathe 10 seconds keep it going we got three push two and one yes shake it out all right team so here is what we got let's get our power with the legs first so we got that jump we're gonna push triceps three two one jump three two one then when we switch it we're gonna go biceps power pulse in the knee so power biceps pulse triceps all right power lunge whatever that is for you whether that's the jump or just power it up and then we're pulsing those triceps back remember elbows to the sky not just here but bring it up here we go power lunge pulse tries three two one Hup. so i've got a decent pace that i'm calling out for you but you do you if you're slower or faster as long as you're still getting low in that lunge that's what matters take it up power lunge pulse your tries take it up and up 10 seconds yes breathe last one shake it out right you feel it more than you think i know i'm always trying to find ways to get more body weight upper body that's not just your push-ups your plank press your tricep dip things like that things where we can get that movement but ha a little different here we go so power knee power biceps pulse in the lunge in three two one here we go power knee and biceps pulse bring it up pulse power strong power and again if you want you can jump it but i still want you to get strong biceps right strong arms power pulse yes breathe keep it moving 10 seconds power Woo. breathe last three two one and relax shake it out just little taps right here yes all right guys look at that that first round just like last week and the week before first round is a little bit of a doozy when we have right side left side remember this is no repeat so now we are done with all that only repeating right side left side grab a sip of water Woo. all right Jacqueline oh no I was in a car accident when you get better try this yes take your time we all wish you speedy healing and recovery thinking about you come back slow when you are ready and when your doctor says you can all right team so shake it out let's just do a little cardio mobility taps to stretch it out through there you watch me Woo. all right I think it's time for a little bit of core right let's take it down Woo! since those legs and arms are feeling it quads be burning that is right Alyssa all right so let's take it here Woo. 
We're gonna do some variations on that basic crunch. Somebody asked me last week about doing crunches and I said I like to keep them really dynamic. So we're gonna start with just your regular crunch. Lift the shoulders, lift the hips, then we're gonna add on. So zip up that core. It's gonna be a burner, but it won't feel as long as that. Let's go 40 seconds. Woo. Now I got a knot in the back of my shirt and that's gonna be in the way. Usually it's the microphone, but that's all right. Let's get it done. Here we go. So lift the hips, lift the shoulders. Really small. What I want you to think about on this is not getting the hips off the ground or getting the shoulders off the ground, but pulling everything in. Remember, we're gonna tilt that pelvis towards us, especially when we're here, bring it in. Tilt the hips towards the ribs. Hips are coming together, ribs are coming together. And we're getting all of that pulling navel to spine, right? And breathe. There we go, yes. Last three, two, one. Stretch it out. All right, so modification, especially if you are pregnant or newly postpartum healing a diastasis is you can take it to that bridge and I'll give you some options once we're there. So modification for this next one is bridge, knee. Take it down, bridge, knee. Everybody else, we're gonna do our basic bicycle. Ready, here we go. Shh. Slow and controlled, it's back to basics. Again, what I want you to think about is not how fast you can go. I actually want you to half time it, take it slow. Think about that rotation, if that twisting is good for you, so we get that rotation in the core. Part of our core's job is to rotate our body. So we wanna be able to do that. We have to do it in life. We wanna do it in workouts. Taking it here. Breathe. Yes. Whoo, there we go. We have five, four, three, two, one. Hug the knees in. All right, so if you're modifying, you're gonna pulse with your bridge, bring one knee in. Pulse with your bridge, one knee in. Everybody else, we're gonna pulse with that little crunch. Bicycle, bicycle. All we got is 20 seconds, and then we're gonna mix it up. Here we go, pulse, three, two, crunch. Bicycle, bicycle. Three, two, burn, twist and twist. Modification, pulse in the bridge. Knee and knee. Yes, let's get one more. Twist and twist. All right, team, here is what we got, little stretch. So if you're modifying, you're gonna pulse with the knee for three and down. Pulse with the knee for three and down. Everybody else, we're gonna pulse Bicycle for three, everything in. Pulse, bicycle for three. What I want you to think about is bringing the knee in just as much as bringing the elbow up, but all of that motion is coming from the core. Are you with me? I think so. 20 seconds is all we need. Three, two, one. Here we go, pulse, bicycle, pulse, pulse, pulse. Full crunch, pulse, pulse, pulse. Think about all those things we talked about. Where is the movement coming? From the core. Knee coming in on that pulse just as much as pulsing in the upper. Yes, you can. One more. Yes, relax. All right, whatever you need to do, you're gonna get a stretch after that. If you wanna go cat cow, if you wanna go up dog, oh, right? Get that stretch. Good agony is right, Faye. Woo! Massimo is gonna do this tomorrow. Up on two, your feet water if you need it more than halfway through this workout. All right, team. Now we have a few more isolations. Less upper and lower. Let's get it done. All right, so we're going to lower body. We're gonna take it with just your basic squat, back to basics. Then your basic side lunge, back to basics. You can keep it stationary if you want or you can step into it. What I want is that hip mobility, hinging at the hips and pushing through on that squat. Also hip mobility, dropping low, powering it up. We got 40 seconds of each of those. We'll put them together with some power and some pulsing, big push for lower body, and then we'll take it down for upper and core. Are you with me? Yes. Woo, abs on fire is right, Alyssa, right? It is still abs 
solution. We got one more week to go. Let's get in that squat position. Core is engaged, everything wrapped in, lifted, squatted. Here we go. Down and up. Low to high, all the way through. Take it down, power up. Yes, you can. Weight in those heels. Remember, knees and toes can go out a bit. Don't worry too much about that. I just want hips to the back, driving up and through and connecting with that core at the top, right? No weight. This should feel easy, right? Daphne's gonna do this later. Yes, good for you. Five seconds to go. Let's keep it moving. Yes, you can. And breathe, shake it out. All right, not so bad, right? All right, side lunge. Again, you can keep it stationary if you want. Sit the hips, push it up and through. Hips pushing up and through. If you wanna travel with it, sit low, push through. Sit low, push through. Drive the hips to the back, push out of those hips and glutes. Ready, here we go. Side lunge and push. Here and push. Take it down and up. There we go. Again, you can keep it stationary. Think about where those hips are going and that you're shifting your weight side to side. Shift the weight, push out of it. Shift the weight, push out of it. Feels like a nice good mobility move too, right? That's why we love this side lunge for mobility. Five seconds, get low. We got three, two, and one. Shake it out. All right, big lower body push, power sculpt. Power with that squat. It's either the jump or it's power squat here, then pulse, pulse, pulse. Back to center, power squat, pulse, pulse, pulse. Let's do it. Here we go. Power squat side. Three, two, one. Power squat. Three, two, one. Stay low with me. Up and down. Get that power. Even if you're not jumping, low. Three, two, one. Yes. Ho. Burn. Legs. And up. We're getting that lateral movement. Again, really good for mobility and flexibility. And that pulse into the hip. Last one. Yes, you can. Finish it out. Burn. Ha. Get your breath, team. I know. I know. All right. Let's take it here. Here is what we got. We're gonna take it. Power, power, three, two, one. Power, power, pulse in that squat. Finish it out. Look at that, 10 minutes less than to go. Let's get it done. Power side lunge, pulse in your squat. Catch your breath. Here we go. 40 seconds right here. Power side lunge. Side lunge, pulse it, get low. Power side lunge, side lunge, pulse for three. Remember when you're pulsing, pulse towards the ground. Drop those hips. Power, power. Don't do what I just did as we get tired. Let your back drop. Really keep that chest open. Yes, you can. Get low and pulse. 10 seconds, and low, last one, power, power, burn, ha, right, catch your breath, water, team, woo, let's take it to the mat, big push for lower body, all right, so, Whew. Let's take it down. Get a little stretch right here in those hip flexors if you want, if that feels good for you. Or here, a little stretch because those quads, hip flexors are working hard. All right, we've got our push up. Look, I know not everybody loves push ups. I don't either. I'm going to do them on my knees because that's better for me and my shoulder. Up to you, knees or toes. 45 degree angle. Remember, not here, not here. Split the difference. It's 40 seconds if you need stretches in between. Get it done. We're going to start with that. 
Big push for upper body, core engage on the knees here to modify, or here, or here, whatever you got. Let's get it done. Three, two, one, push it up. Slow and controlled. Remember, this is our back to basics round. So I don't want you to rush this. I know you got power on the brain. You got pulsing in the brain. Don't worry. It's all coming, but right now, back to basics. Push through. We're getting back of the arms. Lots of triceps. Lots of core. Use your core to lift. Remember, your core is working just as much on this push-up. Lift from the core. Push from that upper. Lift from the core. Navel to spine. Hips to ribs. Three, two, one, and stretch. I know they're hard for me too. They're a great upper body exercise, especially with body weight. All right, if you're modifying on this next one, take it to bird dog. You're gonna get that back stretch from here. If you're able, we're gonna take it down. We're gonna lift Superman out, in, squeeze, and squeeze. So big skydiving pose, zip up that core, bird dog to modify, 40 seconds in three, two, one, lift, squeeze, and out. So it's like my thumbs are going together and then my heels are going together. Whew. Pinkies are coming towards each other in the back as my heels squeeze. Not just here, but lifted, right? So you're lifting those shoulders and those legs off the ground. If it's better for you just to hold there, keep it there. If you can, keep that squeeze moving out and in, right? 10 seconds to go. Try to keep the shoulders and the thighs off the ground as much as you can, or knees rather. Five, squeeze, four, three, two, one. Stretch it up and back. All right, team, you probably know what's coming. So we are gonna get our power push. We're gonna do a little lift pulse. I don't want you to pull in the back on that back pulse, but I want you to really get that lift. So here's our power. We're going all the way down. Three, two, one, power it up. All the way down, three, two, one. Join me here, if you're modifying, you're gonna go bird dog pulse for three, power, push from the knees. Yes, yes, let's get it done. Look at that clock kicking. It is going down, we are so close. Let's make it happen. Power sculpt round in three, two, one. Here we go, take it down, lift. Small lifts for three, power it up. Take it down, lift, bring it up. Yes, lift, squeeze, power it up. Use your core as you come up right here. Think abs, it's a push with your upper, but it's a pull with your core. Let's get it done, lift, lift lift 10 seconds we are so close and up yes last one and up Woo! yes breathe <laughs> shake it out all right team how are we gonna reverse it well i'm so glad that you asked all right so we're just gonna do a big power swim like a breaststroke and then we're gonna pulse with our uh, push-up so actually start here three two one all the way down back to here three two one all the way down I just want you to think power as if you're actually swimming in the ocean squeezing in the back here we go last one right here pulse it push up for three power swim Push up, small little bend and pulse. Power lift. Use your core still on that push. Power lift. Remember, elbows to the back right here. 45 degrees. Not in unless you want that extra trice, but not here putting stress on the shoulders. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Power swim. Pulse, pulse. I know, so much upper, but you can do it. Woo, breathe. Last one, pulse, 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 and back. Stretch, Monica is gonna do it later, yes. Team, whoo. 
All right, catch your breath. Whew. How are we doing, team? Grab a sip of water. Look at that. I guess we got to take it to a bonus move if we're going to have time to get it in. Whew. All right, team. How about a little bonus that gets it all in? You know it, right? All right, so we're going to take it toes out. You're going to pulse it for three. If you want, you can just keep it right there. You can do a little jump at the top. Pulse for three, plie. Take it back, down, three. Drop that hip, bring it up, pop it in. Pulse for three, up, drop it down. So we're sneaking in that little upper. We got core, hip, hip, and we got pulse in the legs. Can we do it? I think we can. Yes, thank you, Wendy, for answering. Yes, we can. Last minute. Then we're cooling it down, zip up that core. If you wanna stay up top, stay up top, just keep the plie ready. Here we go. Pulse three, two, power. Drop it down. Three, two, power. Pulse it. Take it up, drop it down. Try to switch your lead arm and your hip dip. Take it here, let's get hip dip for two so we're not getting off. Right here, two, one, take it up, power, three, two, whoo, yes, and down, two, one, up, and in, yes, you can, we are so close, hip dip, hip dip, bring it up, bring it in, ah, 10 seconds, Hip, hip, up, and here. Three, two, last one. Can you get that hip dip? Time, relax, stretch. You did it, team. Hang out right here. Sit back into those hips. Woo. Child's pose. Everybody hang there. Sink into those shoulders, side to side. Ah. Come up on all fours. Roll through your back, cat cow. At your own pace. Really thinking about that lower lumbar spine. That's where we tend to feel pretty tight, pretty stuck. All the way through. Round it up. And here. If you can, up on the knees, if you need to take it up, standing to get a little hip flexor stretch, we're here, just leaning into it. Again, you can take that standing if that's not comfortable on your knees, depending on your space and your knees, and then lean into it, reach it up, big stretch. Woo! I hope you're feeling it. I know, it's kind of like a lot of you said with yesterday's workout, which is full body core, body weight. Let's take it other side. We always think going into it that body weight is not gonna be that challenging. And then it is, right? Taking it here, reach it up. You can come up off that if you want that little stretch right there. Ha! Seated right through here. So I just want you to do a few little hip rolls if that's good for you. If it's not, you can sit on the edge of the chair and do this but just some little mobility work. Open up those hips, right? And then keep it one side. If it's good for you, get into that pigeon. Otherwise, just sit. You can also cross it over, seated in a chair. Whoo! Tired, y'all. I felt that. Very gently roll through. Other side, taking it here. Ha. Good, good, right here. Knees drop to the side. 
Let's take one arm across, drop it in right here. Roll through. Of course, don't forget to like this video, hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Subscribing is the best thing you can do to help me keep growing the body fit community, to keep making these free workouts for you. Subscribe, share, tell your friends. Take it out right here. Take it over. Woo! Yes, Kirsty added some extra spice, adding weight to the back to basics moves. You are amazing. I bet you really felt that. Yes, good work. Other side, take it right here. And if you're thinking about joining us in the athletic club, you should do it. We are really rocking out Absolution. That is where you get extra support. You get direct access to me, to Vivian, our body fit dietitian. You get the method nutrition plan that is now available in a metric version. I know for all of our friends that use the metric system, basically everybody but Americans, right? <laughs> take it up, take it over. Um, so we have that in the athletic club and we also have live events every week. It is an amazing, supportive, encouraging community. We have Q and A's, we cover hot topics. It's a really fun time. So make sure you join us over there. If that is available to you, take your arms back. Woo! Yes, Jocelyn, speaking of the athletic club, Riley, Vince, and Parker, who have all been watching my, my workouts for a while, ever since Parker, is Parker the youngest, I think? See, this is how I know these people. I've known Jocelyn for a long time through the athletic club and before, but um, I think Parker's the baby. Am I wrong? Tell me if I'm wrong, Joss. Anyway, since the baby was a baby, right? Ah, so good to see you guys here supporting your mom. Mel is sweaty, sweaty, sweaty. Push-ups and Superman pulses, right? Oh, upper body. Imir says that was great. Really tired. Feel the energy up now. Yes, really felt the core. Nice. Imir, it's, it's those kids, right, that make you tired. Again, how do I know these people? From the athletic club. That is the best part about it is that I get to know you. I get to help you on your personal journey. That's super fun for me, but also hopefully really great for you. We can connect a little bit more beyond these workouts, which are amazing. Thank you so, so much for joining me today. Let's get one big deep breath in and out. You did it. That was your body weight power sculpt workout. Great job, everybody. Whew. All right, thank you. Thanks, Tammy. <laughs> Great job doing it all today. We'll see if I can actually shut it down. Yes, Jocelyn. All right, I was right. Parker is the baby who is not a baby anymore. But Jocelyn has been doing the workout since he was a baby. All right, if you have time and you wanna hang out, I'm gonna grab a quick sip of water. If you have any quick questions, let me know. I have just a few minutes because I'm flying solo today. Mmm, gotta get back to the kiddos. So, any quick questions? Yay, Carrie says Absolution has been amazing. If you are just joining us and you aren't familiar, we're doing April Absolution. It's all been core focus. We will continue that as we go, guys, but we've had just more talks about how to truly engage the core, how to get that sneaky core and all those moves, and I think all of you are feeling it. <laughs> Parker wants to clarify that he is now seven. Yes, he is not a baby. Brittany is also loving absolution. All right. So Angela is asking, let's see. Let me make sure I've got you guys. Oh, Kat says, thanks for making the workouts fun. Change my life. Oh my goodness. Thank you, girl. Fittest you've ever been. I'm so glad that you are feeling strong and feeling good. Angela has a question. Walking a couple dogs over the last couple days, I've been feeling my shin since. Can you advise the best way to relieve that tension? So it could just be shin splints. I don't know if you're walking hills. Um, all of that uh, calf stretching that we do, so pushing back, even if you can push against a wall, putting your foot up against a wall or hanging off of a step, all of the calf, but also your tibialis, which is right in the front. So rolling here, or again, putting that up against a step, something like that can be really helpful. Also, um, icing your shins. Shin splints are just those little micro uh, in the bone, so they're kind of annoying. Uh, they can be pretty common. Um, my guess would be if you're walking hills or you're walking at a different pace because maybe some dogs are pulling you, <laughs> um, that's what's happening. But ice, calf, and front of the, front of the leg stretching to be Alice. All right, let's see. Um, 
Mary Allen says, normally don't like push-ups, but today felt good. Yes, I don't like them either, but today is better when we can really mix it up, right? Um, Angela says, no music or time. Oh, did you see my timer though? Hopefully I got the timer working, but no music. Yay. Oh, Teresa, I'm sorry that you're feeling down today, but I'm glad you feel the energy. Good job. All right. Let's see. Yes, Kirsty says, come over to the BAC. It's an amazing, supportive, and positive, safe space. That is also something worth mentioning. It is a safe space where you can talk about your journey. You can get support on your journey. Chances are, if you're feeling it, somebody else has felt it or is feeling it and is going to have some thoughts for you, as well as professional uh, encouragement, advice, support, education from me and from Vivian. Um, all right, let's see, uh, Mara, advice for stretching the psoas muscle, having back issues, thinks it's tight through the psoas. So psoas kind of wraps around, I would say thinking of all those hip and core stretches. I just did, um, a, a, a workout last week. If you missed it, it was called back, hip and core mobility or hip, back and core mobility. I don't know what is first core, back, hip mobility. Anyway, it is from April Absolution, so you'll find it in that playlist, but that could be really helpful. Um, definitely that pigeon stretch, because again, the psoas wraps around into your back and connects. Um, so going through here, that pigeon stress, stretch is really great. Rolling through, of course, cat to cow. I also think if you can do like that down dog to pigeon can be really helpful, even hanging out a few seconds or you know 30 seconds at a time then back to here, back to here, that kind of stuff. Also just making sure you stretch out those hip flexors. So those stretches that we did here and here can be really helpful. But yeah, think, try, check out that back core and hip mobility. It's a mobility workout, but with lots of good deep stretching as well. Um, good, Angela, I'm so glad you saw the timer. Um, yes, sweatshirts should, who's asking about sweatshirts? Um, oh no, Kayla, yes, so, um, there have been a few things. So the supplier that we go through, um, we don't do it ourselves. Uh, we go through a supplier, obviously, because we don't have space to have a bunch of inventory, but also it was very important to us to have um, a place that had a location in Europe. So you could order everywhere, um, but sometimes they do get sold out. Uh, like this particular t-shirt or tank top, I think is sold out right now or out of stock rather. So it's not that we personally are sold out, it's that they're sold out of this material because they print on demand. Because they print on demand, shipping usually takes a little longer, like a couple weeks, um, but they should be back. But I will check on that, Kayla, thank you. Um, thanks, Megan, for coming. Yvonne loves the core focus, making a difference. Oh, I'm so glad. Just can't do it right now, still healing, looking forward to doing it in the future. Tiffany's core has been fire all month. Yes. Um, let's see, Adina's asking, the pigeon stretch supposed to stretch the straight leg or the bed? Both, primarily that front leg. So if we think hip, again, talking about the psoas muscle that wraps around, hip, glute, um, hip flexor, that front leg is where you're gonna get the most. But back here, you're gonna get that hip flexor, that tibialis that I just talked about all the way through and a big hip opener because of this position, right? So both legs, but you're probably gonna feel it a little more on that front hip. Also really good for the back. Betsy, glad to make it today. I'm so glad, felt pretty good returning to workouts. Elbow feels good. Yeah, I had a little injury there, right? Had to modify all the straight arm exercises on the ground. Yeah, just keep modifying. You can also always, if it's something like that push up take it to a chest press, find the complimentary exercise using um, a dumbbell, something like that. So uh, let's see. All right, um, Jess, is the tank on the website? Again, it was out of stock, so I believe we took it down. Um, we also are doing a big overhaul of our website right now. So if you are on Body Fit by Amy uh, the next couple days, and things are running slow or some things aren't there or um, I know our workout pages aren't connected to playlists yet. That is because we're doing a big redo, like a whole rebranding with this new logo, um, working with this amazing website designer. So just so everybody knows, it's just a couple days while we're getting everything in place. Um, so check back early next week and I think everything uh, should be good. But usually if, um, if we took it down, Kurt's in charge of this, so I'm not sure it's because uh, it was either out of stock or we were trying to find a different option. But they are coming. 
Uh, Mira, thank you for creating so many workouts. Thank you, perfect miss. Easy enough to do in the moment, but challenging enough. Yes, that's what I want. Uh, Linda says pulses are not my fave, but needed and so effective. Yes, I think a lot of people would agree with you on that. Um, let's see. I, oh, love locks. Every time I decide to get my life together and get healthy, I always come back to you. Yes, amazing. All right, team. So um, let's see. Okay, if nothing is showing up to buy, that's probably, she's probably working on that page today. <laughs> so check back either later today or tomorrow. I'll also make some announcements in the athletic club. Um, but yeah, anybody who's dealt with the website before knows that, you know, when you're updating like the plugins and like all of the, I, I mean, it's all like a foreign language to me, which is why we have this incredible website designer. Um, but when you're getting everything sort of up and running, uh, there are a few glitches as you're waiting, right? So, um, it's coming though and it's going to look great. All right, team. Anybody else have uh any questions thank you i'm here so easy to show up every day that's all we got to do right we just got to keep showing up i know i say it all the time but it is the truth we got to move our bodies we got to show up for ourselves we got to show up for those people that we love and we just got to keep pushing forward it does not have to be perfect progress not perfection getting it done moving our bodies feeling good that is the name of the game thank you so so much hey deborah yeah you can jump in later um we will see you soon uh next weekend for a live and get excited about what is coming up in may a little preview we're going to go may for ignite all right all the information is coming this coming week but get ready for Ignite, and let's finish out the last week of April Absolution Strong. You guys have rocked it this month, and I'm so proud of you and your super strong functional cores. All right, team. All right. Thank you so, so much. I will see you next time. Let's see if I can shut this down. Oh, oh, oh. Well, all right. All right. Bye, guys.